mountaineer and hobby archaeologist Rita Marstein came across something very special in June 2022. Rita Marstein was out walking in Jotunheimen this summer some 850 meters above sea level, when he saw something strange at the bottom of the mountain lake Tess in La Municipality. The water in the lake is drained every summer in order to produce power. Hobby archaeologist Marstein immediately realized that the short wooden poles he saw sticking up in the low water formed a pattern. I saw that they were placed in a particular system, Marstein says to the Norwegian national broadcaster NRK. According to the Cultural History Museum at the University of Oslo, one of the sticks, or posts as they are called, is now dated to be around 7,000 years old. They are therefore from 1500 BC, which means in the older Stone Age. The find is unique evidence of an ancient fishing tradition in the mountains, the museum writes in the press release. Together with freshwater biologist Trig of Hestigen, Marstein managed to get a fair overview of the poles before the lake was again filled with water over the summer. At least three trapping chambers with guiding fences have been identified at the bottom of the lake. The guiding fences have probably led the fish into the traps, after which the catch could be collected from a boat or by somebody wading out into the water. The fish trapping constructions in Tess are among the oldest of this type from northern Europe. The wood is well preserved, and the archaeologists hope to get detailed information about the exact age of the fish traps, how many years they were in use, how often they were repaired and during which time of the year such repair work was carried out. In 2013 and 2014, traces of extensive Stone Age activity were found along the banks of the Tess. It would have largely been the reindeer that drew hunters and gatherers to these mountains. Traces of the reindeer hunting have been found en masse by the glacial archaeologists in the secrets of the ice program who secure finds that melt out of glaciers in the mountains. The more the ice melts, the older the items they find, from the Bronze Age and recently also from the Stone Age. There have however been great insecurities around whether or not Stone Age people came to the mountains just to hunt and gather, or if they indeed were also catching trout. Divers from the Norwegian Maritime Museum were in the lake on Tuesday to measure the logs, retrieve dating samples and secure the unique cultural heritage against erosion and ice over the winter. Next year, when the ice has melted, land archaeologists from the Museum of Cultural History will begin the excavation. It is so valuable that we cannot take the chance of waiting. Image credit, Rita Marstein.